Hey, this is Navelle J. Lee from BuzzworthyRadio.net here at the 38th Annual Daytime Emmy Awards, which are airing live on CBS at 8 p.m. Eastern tonight. Stay tuned as we interview some of your favorite stars here on the red carpet at the Las Vegas Hilton. Hi, I'm standing here with Julia Pace Mitchell. She plays Sophia on CBS's The Young and the Restless. You look gorgeous. Thank you so much. Absolutely. So, so Sophia is actually in a bad spot going on on this show here. No, she's in some baby daddy drama and, you know. Normal soap drama. No more soap, but it's the two brothers, a little bit of karmic history, you know. <laughs> Drusilla was in the same situation. This is true. So, but I hope to, like, break the curse since I think it's going to happen a little different than people expect it to happen. What would you like to see happen for Sophia? Not, not really with the baby daddy aspect, but with, like, the outcome after that whole thing. Like, what would you like to see Sophia do? I would love for her to start her own corporation within Tucker McCall Unlimited and have, like, a cosmetic line or See? some kind of, you know, black beauty company in Genoa City and like her and Neil get together and start because they've been working. They start their own empire. Okay. Because they've been working for people for a long time and it's 2011, almost 12. I think it's time for the winners and to come up in a different way. I do. I really do think that the winners family as well as yourself need to be shown on, on screen more and have like more front burner storylines. I mean, I love the fact that you, your characters have been on recently because of what was going on with the Kane Lily storyline and the feel like that so I think that's mighty impressive and they need to use that use that some more I think it's gonna happen I think the fans know that it's time for it to happen and I think we got hired some new writers you know and so there are a lot of people Victoria Rouse supporters who are talking about getting things behind the scenes and on the scene and I think she paved the way for some of that so we hired some new writers on the show so it's really exciting to be a part of that right now so, yeah I honestly I, I I said this, I was like, I want Neil to be the daddy, but we'll see. <laughs> I want Tucker to be the daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine if Tucker was the... Oh, God. Uh, that would be a, people, something people would not expect. That would be in the National Enquirer. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going to happen. That's not going to happen. <laughs> no. But cool. Nice to meet you, too. Nice to meet you, too. Hi. I met you before. We did. We met at home tonight. Yeah.